This is Aaron with ANET Computers from ANETcomputers.com. I have another blog post with a potential fix for an issue with Windows XP and Service Pack 3. Service Pack XP 3 fixes for, quote, access denied, unquote, error messages. Some users are reporting that they are receiving a, quote, access denied, unquote, message when trying to install Windows XP Service Pack 3. I am going to show you today some potential fixes for this error. One potential fix is to reboot the computer and then trying to install Surface Pack 3 manually by downloading and running the Surface Pack 3 install file from Microsoft and that's a link to that actual download where it says Microsoft XP Service Pack 3. Another fix is assuming you have been trying to install Service Pack 3 with an administrator account. You can try resetting the security settings for Windows XP. A system file may be locked for some reason. You can follow the short tutorial from Microsoft to reset your security settings. Another link to instructions for that tutorial. Another possibility would be to reboot you, your computer, then disabling any antivirus or AdWare spyware applications you have installed, and then attempting to install Service Pack 3. You can follow the tutorial for this from Microsoft. Go ahead and skip to method number two under resolution since you have already tried method one under resolution and another web link below. A fourth possibility, if none of the methods above work, is to reset the registry and file permissions. This is an advanced method and can be completed by following method one under advanced troubleshooting section under that Microsoft Support XP link below that paragraph. Here's just a graphic of a computer that stipulates that Service Pack 3 was successfully installed. You can also read through the prerequisites before installing Service Pack 3 if you'd like from Microsoft. There are also some additional troubleshooting steps in that article for access denied errors when attempting to install Service Pack 3 in, and that's a Windows XP tech support Microsoft article link. You might want to keep any of the Windows XP Service Pack 2 updates under Add and Remove Programs in case you want to roll back to Service Pack 2 in the future. Sometimes KB911895 fails to install after upgrading to Windows XP Service Pack 3. You can browse to C colon Windows System32 drivers and then delete or rename the WDF01000. Sys file. After deleting or renaming the file, you go to Windows Update and select Custom, then select Hardware Updates and HID Non-User Input Data Filter. Should be there again. Now, select Download and Install. Hopefully, KB911895 will install successfully. Another option if that doesn't fix the KB911895 problem is to then boot into Safe Mode and download and install the update manually from Microsoft and that's from that patches Microsoft hyperlink. So you can subscribe to my YouTube channel if my information was productive and helped you fix those potential access denied errors when trying to install Surface Pack 3. You can always browse to anetcomputers.com for free tips and information. Thank you for listening.